With this year marking the 70th anniversary of the end of World War II, the United States is calling on Japan to improve and strengthen its relations with its neighbors. This follows Japanese Prime Minister Shinzo Abe's comments Monday that he would reflect on Tokyo's past wrongdoings in a fresh statement that will be released in the summer. EGM reports. Heading into 2015, Japan faces a critical year in diplomacy, as this year marks the 70th anniversary of Japan's surrender in World War II. U.S. State Department spokesperson Jen Psaki said Tuesday that Japan's heartfelt apology would go a long way. Our view is that the apology is extended by previous Prime Minister Murayama and former Chief Cabinet Secretary Kono marked important chapters in Japan's efforts to improve relations with its neighbors. Former Japanese Prime Minister Domichi Murayama and former Chief Cabinet Secretary Yohei Kono both apologized for Japan's wartime aggression in 1995 and 1993, respectively. The U.S. has been prodding Tokyo to improve its ties with Korea, as Washington wants to strengthen its trilateral alliance in the region to counter China's rise. Japanese Prime Minister Shinzo Abe said this week that he would, quote, show remorse for Japan's wartime atrocities. That statement will come in August, on occasion of Japan's surrender in the Second World War. However, Abe stopped short of saying whether it would include an actual apology. Japanese public broadcaster NHK reported Wednesday that the government will start working on the statement this month. The team putting it together will include women as well as historians and media personnel. Japan's relations with its neighbors have chilled in recent years, as Japan continues to deny responsibility for its past wartime aggressions. Lee Jun, Arirang News.